It is a significant increase, but I think that it's going to pay off. Really, it's going to be a, an asset for our community. We're doubling the number of sheets of ice for hockey, both varsity hockey and youth hockey with this facility. The West Fargo School Board makes a unanimous decision to move forward with a new hockey facility that would accommodate both West Fargo and Cheyenne varsity and junior varsity hockey teams. Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us. Mike has the evening off. The money for the facility was approved by voters in the fall as part of the $98.1 million bond referendum. Tonight, the board approved the new design that would cost $14.6 million, an increase of about $2 million. Valley News Team's Yovana Simich tells us what this new rink means to the community. I think we have to just pull you up and, and get, get the job done and get the facility built. West Fargo Public School officials came to an agreement that a new hockey rink needs to be built. We are able to do that by uh, adding a few more square feet, reconfiguring where the locker rooms are located, and the board appreciated and liked that plan well enough that they were willing to free up dollars that have been saved in the other projects and some of the contingency dollars um, to go forward with that plan. Board members say this rink is a necessity since the community has a shortage of ice and the city of West Fargo keeps growing. The thing that the board really wanted accomplished uh, in the back to the drawing board phase was to make sure that this facility has the capacity um, to host for practice as well as competition games uh, two or more hockey teams. The updated design features more locker room space as well as a bigger seating area, a facility that is going to cost more than two million dollars over budget. But in the end, board members believe it will better the sport in West Fargo. I think we have to plan for the future. We know that hockey's not going away. If we did, we wouldn't be building this facility in the first place. A rink that will be vital for the growing hockey community. In West Fargo, Yovana Simic, Valley News Live. Board members say they hope to start construction by the end of the summer.